Hey everyone, what's up and welcome back to I Make Your Videos guys. It's been so long since I did a Pokemon Go video and today guys, we are going to be showing you guys all the shinies that I've caught during this year, 2021. So happy new year to all of you guys. I'm pretty sure this video will be uploaded somewhere around the 30th. So yeah, so somewhere around the 30th. So make sure to see that guys. Um, so today guys, we're going to be showing you all the shinies that I've caught, all the hundos, um, the legendaries, the cool ones. Without further ado, let's get right into it. So as you all know guys, 2021 is over, yeah it's over, and yeah, we've made a lot of videos. I guess around, somewhere around like 65 videos, which is really good, not bad, not bad at all. So we made over 65 videos, very cool. So today, we're going to be showing you guys all the shinies that I've caught and my brother. So before that, I just want to tell you guys, go to my Instagram because I do a lot of videos. I'm very active over there. If you want to ask me anything, you can go ask me over there. So make sure to go to my Instagram and I'll check out all the shinies I've caught. I do, you know, shiny shorts. That's what they call Instagram reels. So I do a lot of that st stuff there. I'm also planning to do some shorts in this channel because I've, I've done my new short video, which was all about this $1 Lego set. And also my in my TikTok because I recently started TikTok right now. So, you know, I really recently uploaded that, you know, shorts, that shorts video. That you know that Lego shorts. I'll leave that in the links in the description. It's just the next video. It's just the previous video. I mean, it's just the previous video. So yeah. So today we're gonna be showing you guys all the shinies that I've caught, my brothers and mine. So the reason why I'm including my brother here is that at the beginning of my Pokemon Go game, um, I was only playing alone. I was kind of bored. So maybe after two weeks or so, I created another account, and that was like for for me, you know, doing all the trades and all the gifts, you know, sending gifts and becoming best buddies. So that was the other reason. So, and the main reason why I'm also including my brother is that um, at the beginning, I did like three coming days. Um, I did like three coming days with my both accounts. And then after that, only I gave it to my brother. So, um, so I have caught a lot of shinies and that's why I have, I'm also including my brothers. And also the Lugia, remember guys? The Lugia, the shiny Lugia that we caught, um, me and my brother, we did a raid. It was so cool. So I'll come to that later, guys. That's my brother's account, so I'll come to that later. And I've also done that on the on my Instagram, so make sure to check that out. So the reason why I'm including my brother is because at the beginning I've caught I've caught quite a lot of shinies in that account too. So yeah, that's why we're including our brother. My brother's catches and my catches will be here. So I'll also leave those you know chapter thing that they've added. YouTube has added, so I'm gonna also include that so you can you know directly skip to wherever you want to go. And yeah, this is gonna be a cool video. Without further ado, let's get right into it. So guys. We're going to be showing you guys the shinies I've caught. Starting with my main account, which is me, level 38, here. So let's start with all the shinies that I've caught. So I presently have uh, 170. And so yeah, these are the shinies that I've caught. This is the December coming day, as you can see. Somewhere around 16 shinies in December coming in today. So let's see. Yeah, 16 or something, which is not bad. Actually, I went to Dubai Mall to actually catch them. So yeah, um, these are the shinies I've caught. December coming day shinies. Just quite cool, though. So let's start with our first ever shiny. Let's go. This is gonna be very funny. So this is my first ever shiny, a Dwebble. Um, the thing is with the Dwebble is that like, I didn't even know like, there was a shiny Dwebble existing. So yeah, I got this when I was like level 20 or something. I caught this when I was level 20. So what I assume is that when you reach level 20, you have a higher chance of getting shiny. So yeah, um, so I got this at level 20. So this is what it is, my first ever shiny Pokemon. So I got it in the um, spotlight hour, if I'm not wrong. It's very old, I guess. So I caught in the in my spotlight hour, as you can see here. Dwebble was caught on sixth, sixth first, so first of sixth. So you know, so yeah, I got in the spotlight hour. Then I don't know this, but I might I might be the only person to have this luck here. Then the next day, the next day, as you can see, guys, the next day I got my shadow shiny. Sixth second, I got my shadow shiny. That's insane. I did the evolution in my Instagram, so make sure to check that out. So the next day I got my second shiny. This was so funny that I got my second shiny on the next day, which is insane. So coming to the next Pokemon is the, you know, Hulk. Um, so this was my first ever shiny, this thing. I guess I have a video of it. Um, this was, again, the next day after this guy. So it was a streak, it was a streak. As you can see, this was caught on third. The Hulk was caught on third. And this was caught on the second. Then, as I, I'll tell you guys, then the next day I got a shiny torching. What the hell? Yeah, the next day I got a shiny torching. That was quite insane. So the next day I got a shiny torching. I didn't even expect to get one, so yeah. Then after that we have a Growly, which is the next day after this, guys. On 5th, 4th and 5th, so we're talking about streak. And of course, at 6th we had the Gibble coming day, so that's when I got the Gibble coming day Pokemons. So this was my first shiny Gibble, if I'm not wrong, so yeah. So... 
as I just said, we got the streak here, a complete streak, and so this was the coming day where I got somewhere around how many shinies? Um, let's quickly see. We got over, we got over 24 if I'm not wrong, 23, and I guess we're missing, ah, 26, it's not bad. So we got over 23 shinies, which is not bad, and I kind of missed out three more. I kind of missed three shinies because I didn't have enough Pokeballs and I was playing in home, so yeah. Because of the COVID and all that thing, so I was playing inside my house. And so this is where I got it, and then we got that we evolved this one because it was a high CP. Um, yeah, it was the highest CP, so I evolved this one. It was good IV. It was two star because I'm kind of unlucky with shiny, you know, shiny two stars like with shiny good IVs. I'm kind of unlucky with that, so yeah. Um, so this was it. And then let me show you my 98 IV. So I'll just show you guys my 98 IV Pokemon that was con this is still my most favorite, Garchomp 98 IV guys. I don't know, but we got the Garchomp 98 IV as you can see here. So this is where I got my Garchomp 98 IV. Um, so yeah, during the Kameen day. And then let's go back, let's go back to the recent. Um, so yeah, then after that, the next day, I mean, I guess not the next day, I don't know when was this, just a second. Um, this is somewhere around 6th, 12th, so you know, one week after this. So that's when I got this guy, Crystal, which is the evolution of the Dwebble. So I got another shiny Dwebble, two shiny Dwebbles. What is going on? Two shiny, shiny Dwebbles. I guess I got it when I was when I went outside. So yeah, then I got the god himself, this guy. Uh, what's called um, uh, this thing, Bidoof. So this was in the Kamid. This was in the Bidoof special day, which was, which is kind of cool. So, so then we got this guy here, which knows the Ice type move. I'm not wrong. Yeah, Ice Beam, and I caught it in the you know, in the 29th of June. So that's kind of cool. So this is where I caught. I didn't even notice that I got a shiny this thing, shiny Bidoof. I really caught a lot of shiny uh, Bidoof. As you can see with the candies, so I kind of caught a lot. So yeah, and it was kind of a cool thing. Then after that was the Kameen day that I caught the, the Kameen day, the the typical Kameen day, which is kind of cool, and one of the coolest shinies. And I guess this is my the evolution is my three star shiny if I'm not wrong. So yeah, and I kind of have a lot of female shinies. I'll come to that later. Why I'm talking about and why I'm saying female shinies, I'll just come to that later because. Um, I'll just tell you guys later, actually. So we have Embor, and then after this, this one I caught somewhere around 24, if I'm not wrong. So let's see how much we caught. 24. Um, yeah, we got 15. Oh, we got 15. That's very less. Then I got a Gibble. So this was actually traded for my brother. So I thought we'll get a good IV. We did a reroll, and it turned out to be a bad IV. So yeah, we, we were kind of unlucky with that. Then I got this guy, which I recently evolved. Um, I'll, I'll put that on Instagram. I just recently evolved this Pokemon here, her dear. See, as you can see, six uh, li uh, Lillipop candy. So this one, I actually got it when I actually went to a beach. When I actually went to Jumeirah Beach, I got it. So kind of cool. We got it when I, I got it when I went to the Jumeirah Beach. And this is a three star. Yeah, this is a three star. So yeah. Then we got the Mel Metal here from the, you know, that, you know, the time with the, the this thing, five year anniversary thing. So I was actually, I actually got two Mel Metals, as you can see here. I got two Mel Metals and uh, this is my 50th one. And then just right after that, the second encounter, the second encounter was the shiny I caught here. So as you can see here, the second encounter was the shiny here. So first I caught this and then, then I caught this. So yeah, as you can see, this is the one I really love this Pokemon. So I plan to evolve a non-shiny one, but luckily we got a shiny and I evolved it. It's kind of cool. So yeah, this is like a shiny deck entry for me. And then this thing came in, of course, my, uh, what do I call it? This one. I forgot the name. It's the Go Fest. We did a video on the Go Fest, and we got this guy here, cool guy. We got the 96 IV. This is another three star I have. Then a Wishmer, and all these Pokemon, which I also talked about it in the in this thing. And uh, I got Dino, which is one of the most rare Pokemon to get shiny off. So we got two, not one, two. That's kind of awesome. And I'm planning to evolve this during coming day, which I hope will come this 2022. So yeah. Then we have uh, my, my favorite Pokemon here, Latias. Here, as you can see, and as you can see, another female shiny. So my first ever shiny legendary is a female shiny here. Uh, my first ever three-star shiny was a female here. That's why I'm coming. That's why I'm trying to say that it's an old female shiny, all that thing. And my first ever shadow shiny is a female. So, you know, I don't know what is this, but I guess Pokemon Go likes you know female shinies. And the next thing after that was a female shiny. So yeah, and so it's kind of funny though, awkward. But yeah, that's why I I know I was saying like female shinies and all that thing. I was kind of you know saying that. But it's very awkward to get the, you know, my first ever Shadow Shiny is a female. My first ever three star Shiny is a female. Then my first ever Shiny Legendary is a female. What is going on? Yeah, so that's why I just, you know, I was mentioning this female Shiny thing and all that thing. So yeah, then came in the Lotad again from the last Shiny that I caught during the, um, this thing. Go Fest. 
And this was quite funny. The Great Wall was kind of funny. I don't, I don't think I have the video, but I'm pretty sure I saved it somewhere. I mean, it should be in my, you know, photos. I'll just check that out. And so, yeah. Great Wall. This is also when I went to Dubai Mall or something. I didn't go to Dubai Mall. Actually, when I was actually outside, I caught it. So, yeah. I went outside and I caught it. It was kind of funny. And this was the Ultra Unlock Part 1 from Philippe. So, yeah. Ultra Unlock Part 1. Then we got the Shiny Espion. This was from the... Um, you know the five star the you know the five year special event jumpstart research yeah it's the jumpstart research so i got the jumps i got in the jumpstart research so yeah then we got the uh this shiny from ultra unlock here that, that was the jumpstart research shiny that i was talking about sorry guys me my um uh, my earpods start to like you know reconnect every single time i have to reconnect it for some reason i don't know i have to give it to apple store to you know clean it fix it so yeah then that's when i got the espion here i evolved it into an espion because I was, you know, doing too much running, and then at the end, I found out that uh, the coming day had that, you know, special, you know, glitch thing that they call uh, for evolving. So yeah. Then we have this guy, Magneton. I don't think so. Yeah, I guess this was a night shiny. Night shiny by night shiny, I mean, is like the shiny that I catch during night time. So yeah, this was a night shiny. I guess I have a video of it. I'll check that out. But yeah, this was a night shiny, meaning I caught it at night. So yeah. Then we have the shiny legendary. We had that. I mean, I showed that in my, you know event in that you know event video so you guys can check that out and then i caught this my caddy here i just named it my caddy because cool again it's a female shiny as i said so yeah so it's kind of funny but yeah i caught this when i went outside if i'm not wrong i went when, when i went outside i caught its pre-evolution which is skill so yeah kind of cool then we have trico i get another female shiny so yeah this trico i remember catching it at 12 a.m so yeah it was kind of funny i caught it at 12 a.m and i have a video of it i don't know where it is i'll check that out and maybe even show you guys the video then Flareon from the Kamid Day, if I'm not wrong. So yeah, this was a night shiny, by the way. Chico is a night shiny. I'm just waiting for my swamp, uh, so for um, Mudkip shiny, just you know, because Mudkip is my favorite Pokemon. So yeah, I'm just waiting. I got all the three starters, uh, all the two, but I'm 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 missing Mud Mud uh, I'm missing Mudkip. So yeah. Then this Kamid Day came in the event, the December Kamid Day. I evolved quite a lot of Selvion because you know so is kind of good for raids. Selvion is kind of good for raids, so I evolved a lot of Selvion here, um, and caught somewhere around 50 shinies, if I'm not wrong. Exactly 50 shines. I have that in my Kamid Day video. Make sure to check that out also. Um, so as you can see, I got over 50 shinies here. So yeah, just let me show you guys right away. So somewhere around 50 shinies. I tried getting all of them and I got all of them. Actually, I got all of them, but my brother didn't get all of them. So I have to trade that other guy that I was talking about back then. So yeah, I did trade that anyway. So yeah, so we got somewhere around 48. And so the other one was from a trade. So I did trade the other one. So yeah. We exactly got 50, so I traded two of them if I'm not wrong, so yeah, I did trade two of them, so yeah. Then we got the um, Swellow here, as you can see, Swellow. This was in the same, in, in my house, so I caught it in my house, so yeah. So as you can see, then I caught Swellow. Um, I, I kind of changed my earphones, because it's not working, so yeah. The, uh, this thing lost its battery, so it charged, so yeah. Um, so then I caught Swellow, this is again outside. Um, after that, the garbage. This one was a night shiny, if I'm not wrong. This was a night shiny. I caught it if I was, if I'm not wrong, I got it at 10 a.m. if I'm, 10 p.m. I caught it at 10 p.m. or 11, so yeah. I was playing at night, I was kind of bored, I was not sleepy, so I was playing at night, and I caught this guy. Um, rubbish. It's kind of cool rubbish, cool rubbish Pokemon, but yeah. Then you have Swellow here. This was at night, if I'm not wrong. Yeah, this was again not night, no, this was morning, if I'm not wrong. I don't know when, but I'm pretty sure I caught it at morning. Uh, I guess I have the video. I'll check that out later. I'll check that out because I have quite a lot of Pokemon, you know, records. So maybe if I do it like an Instagram post, but I currently have quite a lot of them and I didn't post most of them. So yeah, I'll just see that. Then I got Oshawott coming day, which I didn't hunt that much because I had exams during that time. So RIP Oshawott, but I don't really mind about because I evolved it in the, in the, in the end. I evolved it. So I called this Saimuru. 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 It's like a Japanese like theme to it. So this one, I use it mostly for the Great League, it's very powerful, I mean for the Ultra League, it's very powerful. So yeah, I mean I have a good IV of it, so let me just quickly check about that, check that. Samurot, Samuroto. We have the Samuroto here, this is maxed out. I'm not maxed out, like Great IV maxed out, I mean Ultra League IV maxed out, so yeah, Ultra League CP maxed out. So yeah, then I, uh, this, 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 this is the one I caught, so, um, just a second. So yeah, this is the one I caught, and then after that we have the Fashion Week event. Um, then we had the Fashion Week event, so I caught this at 9, 9.25, I caught it at 25th of uh, um, 9th, 9th 25th, so I caught 9th 25th, and this was the same day, so this was my next, you know, shiny luck, so, you know, that's why I named it like two shinies in one day, so as you can see, just the next second after that, so I went outside, I guess I went outside if I'm not wrong, 
and then um, yeah I just went outside I went outside to do some couple of raids and when I came back um, I got both of these guys I got both of these guys yeah kind of cool Butterfree my shiny Butterfree so this is my only shiny Butterfree that I have so yeah and then we got the Dutch Code coming which I didn't play that much um, the reason why I keep like 11.59 here is because I would know like you know how many shinies I catch because I made this couple of kind of formula here so I hope this formula works for you guys so per hour I get 4 shinies so 4 times 6 is 24 and you add one more if you're lucky so something like that so that kind of works for me all the time so as you can see my e EV coming there I got over um oh, let's also include this guy let's also include this other EV that I had here so just a second let's also include this so with all that, I have somewhere around 49, and the other one was traded, so 50, so 50 divided by 2, 25, 25. So per day, I got, uh, per hour, I got 4 shinies. So if you calculate like that, I would, you know you'd feel satisfied. So, of course, with an incense. So yeah, that's why I did these naming things to calculate how much shinies I get. So I got um, somewhere, I didn't really hunt for this Pokemon, because this Pokemon wasn't that strong, and I already have a hundo of it, which I'll come to that later. Um, so yeah, then I, I got the Cyndaquil. Um, I got this at night, if I'm not wrong. I catch a lot of shinies at like 6 p.m. or 7 p.m. I don't know when this was, 7 p.m. if I'm not wrong, Cyndaquil. So one of my favorite starters, by the way. My favorite starter, actually, is Cyndaquil, so yeah. Then I got the Ziggy Zagoon. I call this Ziggy Zagoon because it's kind of a funny name. I'm not evolving it yet because I'm waiting for the Obstagoon to come and I wanted to get a deck center of the Obstagoon. Then I got this Cricketoon, which I have it on Instagram, so make sure to check that out. And then, of course, the Shinx Kami Day. I also have all the sh shinies that I caught during Shinx, Shinx Kami Day, so yeah. As you can see all of them this one glammy out is kind of a funny thing so what happened was i was really about exit that because i was playing in the ar mode so you might not clearly be able to see that pokemon so i was about to exit that and i was able to see that shiny sparkles and i was like what i got a shiny and it turned out to be a glammy out kind of cool and fun fact i was actually thinking like it would be kind of funny if i get another shiny a different shiny instead of the coming day one and i kind of got it just kind of funny it's kind of funny um then we got the shinx um luxray i evolved quite a lot of luxrays because I like it. It's kind of cool though. Luxray is kind of cool. It's one of my favorite Pokemon. So I evolved Luxray. And then my 150th shiny. This is my 150th shiny here. Um, I got it from one of the uh, one of my friends from Pokemon Go. So yeah. This is my 150th shiny here. So as you can see, kind of bad here. Then we got the Volibee. This was traded for my brother because he got it my in, in his first try and I didn't even get one. And it was kind of a bad IV. It was like a two star. So, and then I decided to evolve it. So, anyways, so I, I'm I'm trying to evolve this soon. So yeah. And then came the December coming day, which is kind of awesome. No good IVs in December coming day, but we got all the shinies. And this one, the Raihan here, I didn't rate it. I got it from the research, as you can see. I got it from the research encounter that he had. So yeah. And then Talon Flame, the last shiny I got. It was lucky. It was quite a lucky. So yeah, kind of quite lucky. So yeah, these are all the shinies I've caught. 170 shinies. My expectation for the next year should be doubled, so I'm expecting to get somewhere around uh, 250 something, something like that, 240 shinies. Technically doubled, so yeah. And so yeah, let's now talk about some of my favorite Pokemon here. Quilava Buddy, my first ever starter Pokemon, so I love Cyndaquil, one of my favorite starters, so yeah. And this is my first ever Pokemon, if I'm not wrong, excluding Charmander, and I sent that Pokemon to a Pokemon Shield because I don't like Charmander that much, I'm not a Charizard fan. I'm a Cyndaquil, uh, Cyndaquil and a Blastoise fan because Blastoise is one of my favorite. Uh, Blastoise, uh, my first ever favorite Pokemon starter is a uh, is the Quilava, then then is the Blastoise, and then if I'm not wrong is Swampert and you know Blaziken. So yeah, so because my favorite generation is the Gen 2 game. So yeah, so this is when I caught this guy here. Then I got this here. It's kind of cool this Pokemon. I'm planning to evolve this guy. I'm planning to evolve this Pokemon here. I hope to evolve it soon. Cause that's why I'm kind of hunting a lot, so I'm kind of hunting a lot of candies. And this one here, my OG Pokemon, I finally got to, a chance to evolve it. So yeah, Dragon Breath and Outrage. So I caught this long back. Um, let me just see when I caught this Pokemon here, Dragonite. So I caught it in uh, fifth thirteenth. So in the beginning of my Pokemon Go. So this is when I first started Pokemon Go. So this is on the fifth third. So in a couple of weeks, I just got this guy here. So yeah, I'm very happy I caught this Pokemon. And finally got a chance to evolve it using the Jumpstart research because they give us a lot of candy. So I evolved my favorite starter and it turns, I mean my favorite, I mean, I evolved my, I evolved my OG Dragonite and it turns out to be a female Dragonite. So yeah, that's what, female Dragonite here. So yeah, these are a couple of Pokemons I caught. I thought of evolving this one, Fletchlander, but nah, it was a hatched Pokemon. So yeah, I really don't need it. So yeah, I don't need it. So yeah. And then we had the Piplup thing that I want to evolve. So I also didn't evolve because I had a better high CP one. So. 
I love that one here. And then all these old Pokemons here. So then I had this my boy Pokemon. The me the reason why I'm the reason why I'm naming it my boy is because um my first ever legendary is a uh, my first ever legendary, so that's why I'm naming it my boy. And then for the female one, the first ever shiny legendary, I named it my girl. And yeah, that's what it is. Then I had I evolved with this one with using that name technique. And then uh, we got a Hondo Machamp. A Hondo Machamp. So these are let's let's show you guys my Hondos right now. My 100% IV Pokemons. So these are all my perfect Pokemons. This one I guess I have it in my Instagram, so make sure to check it out. And again, Shadow 100 IV guys. Shadow 100 IV. And it turned out to be a female. So that's why I'm saying you know female something. You know this thing going on here. So it's a Hondo, 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 and Hondo. So all this Hondo. So I don't I didn't even care about it. I might teach it the you know special move, the community move, but I doubt I would because this Pokemon is um, Dust Call is not that powerful too. So yeah, this was from a, a Hondo from this thing, from the um, research, I guess. Let's see. Yeah, it was from the oh, it's from the Ultra League. Yes, I caught it when I won, won the Ultra League, and it was recent. It was just like it was actually it was just three days ago. What? Yeah, it was actually three days ago. It was 12, 25, 20, 21. So this was three days ago, and this was 18. Spin rack, um, spin rack was 18. Yeah, yeah, it was 18. So this one I caught it three days ago. And this was caught during the December coming day. I was, you know, you know, uh, I was going through my what they call. I was going through my um, this thing, this Pokemon space here. I was going through that, and I found a, a Hondo. It was quite funny. It was about deleted, but luckily I found it, and I didn't delete it. So yeah, this was just caught two years ago. That's kind of cool. I didn't even expect that. Um, so we'll do point evolution. Should I? I don't think so. I would right now. I'll do it later. I'll keep it, you know, safe. I'll do it later. And this was the Shadow Hondo that I got. I mean, Shadow Hundred IV. So yeah. These are the shinies that I've personally caught, the Hondas that I've personally caught. Um, if you exclude purified Pokemons, then this is how much I have. I have five and the other three. No Shundos in this account. Why I'm saying this account? Because I have a Shundo there in my brother's account, so yeah. So this is what I caught. Um, so these are all the shinies I've caught during this year and the Hondos and some good Pokemons and good mentions. So yeah. And also this guy, I got a very high CP, so weather boosted here in Dubai. And because in Dubai it's sunny weather most of the time, so I got a maxed out weather boosted coming day level 40 Pokemon with Rock Racker. So yeah. So this is some honorable mentions. This one also is good. And this was my 98 shiny legendary. This is my 98 legendary here. My second raid. So this one is my second raid and I got it. I have I'm believe, I believe I have it on my Instagram. So yeah. And rush around here. So yeah. And we have the shiny and all these other Pokemons that we have here. So yeah, that's it guys. These are all the shinies I've caught during this coming this year. And all the good IVs and some honorable mentions. So thank you guys. Now it's time for my brother. And so let me show you my brother's shinies. Now this is my brother's account here. He doesn't really have good IV Pokemons. I mean high CP Pokemons because uh, he relies on me most of the time. So yeah. It's because he's highest is still Garchomp which we did a lucky trade. So yeah, we're kind of lucky with this. And again, a lucky female. So yeah. So as you can see, that's why the female shiny is kind of a cool thing in here. So yeah, um, now this is our shiny legendary that I caught. This was actually me and my brother raiding. So as I said, we're planning to trade this thing for a good IV because Lugia is my favorite legendary. My favorite legendary because I'm a big fan of gold and silver game. So that's why like my favorite starter is, it's always both together. So I always, you know, consider um, a, a, a Swampert. I mean, not Swampert. I always consider... Um, Blastoise and um, this thing together, what's called Blastoise and um, um, Quilava together. So that's why I like both of them together. Like they, both of them are like my most favorite shinies. I mean, most favorite legendary, I mean starters. Then like comes the Swampert and Blaziken. So Swampert and Blaziken together, um, and the other two are together. So my first, my most favorite shinies are, uh, my fo most favorite uh, starters are um, Quilava and uh, Cyndaquil and, you know, and, and Squirtle. Then comes the, my second most shiny, my second most favorite starter is um, uh, our, uh, this guy's, um, both of them, both the stars from Kami, this thing, Gen 2, uh, Gen 3 I mean, which is um, the Blaziken, I love Blaziken Evolution, and um, the Swampert. So yeah, now I'll show you guys all the shinies that I've caught during here. 57 C, as you can see, we didn't hunt that much, and my brother sadly didn't have enough bag space to, you know, play December coming day, so yeah. My brother didn't have enough bag space to play December coming day, so let's show you my first ever shiny here. So the starter, the coming day shinies, these are like the coming day shinies in here, so this is not a big deal. So I was hunting all this thing. Uh, I was actually hunting, hunting all of this thing, so yeah, I hunted all of them. 
So this was a three star, so as you can see, three star, good IV. And I won't evolve it right now, maybe in the December coming days. Let me just write it here, my brother. Hopefully you evolve it in December coming day. December 2020, rip, I'll just call it Gibble 2022. So yeah, so you can evolve it in 2022, so yeah. Makes sense, so we'll evolve this in 2022. And then we'll have, we have the M board coming day. And here's my wild try, this, I caught it personally, and again, a female. So this was like, you know, the reason why I'm saying first wild shiny is I'm, I'm like in club, in the shinies that I've not caught in my main account. I've not caught in my main account. So this is my first shiny in the alt account that I've not, that I don't have in my main account. So yeah. Um, so, so that's why I call it, I called it bros special shiny so that it's only for him. I don't have it. So yeah. So this is a clefable that I caught. Um, this is kind of funny. I actually went outside and I was actually looking at it and I didn't have a, um, I actually went outside with my main account and I'm playing some Pokemon Go. I guess to Mall of the Emirates, if I'm not wrong. So I went to Mall of the Emirates. And so what happened was uh, my backspace was full. So I decided, to, you know, I decided why not let's play in my main account uh, with my brothers in my alt account. So that's when this happened. I caught my first ever wild shiny here. So then we got a shop it. This was from the this thing, research. So this is from the this thing, the ultra unlock research. If I'm not wrong. So yeah. Then Espion again. Espion all these Pokemon. We all know this. This is from the December coming day. And then we got a 96 IV. I was so jealous that my brother caught this 96 IV. So. He again got it from a research, so two research Pokemon. These time research Pokemon, so those research would end out. So yeah, time research Pokemon. So he got two shinies from that. Two shinies. Like I was so jealous he got two shinies. So yeah, it was kind of funny that he got two shinies. Then came in the Luigi Let's Go. This is Luigi Let's Go. I named it Luigi Let's Go because Lugia, Luigi, of course. Luigi is my favorite uh, Mario franchise character. He's my favorite. No one can beat him. Luigi is awesome. So yeah. Then sorry, that's why I named it Lu Luigi. And also in my original um, Let's Go, I mean Pokemon, uh, this thing, uh, Pokemon Sil uh, Gold, I named it also Luigi. So for that, you know, for that commemoration, I named it Luigi. So then here, my brother played this. So you know, he only played for some time because he was kind of bored and he didn't want to play that much. So yeah. Then, then, dude, this this made me jealous, so jealous. He got a Hundo. He got a Hundo shiny. Fun fact, you might be asking me why you didn't catch it because it would have been a Hundo for you, right? Too bad. I just caught this, so this was my, I, I caught this one, not my brother, so I just caught this one, so not my brother, my brother was sleeping, so I just, you know, why not just catch it here, so I caught in my alt account, which is technically my brother's account, so I caught in my brother's account right away, so, and it turned out to be a shiny, so when I caught this shiny, it was very funny, so my brother was sleeping, he was sleeping, so I used his iPad, um, and then the first thing I did is, let's encounter this, uh, this thing, let's encounter this, um, uh, what's it called, what's his name, uh, what's it called, I forgot, what's it called, uh, what's it, uh, yeah, Venonat, so, let's encounter this Venonat, and I was thinking inside, like, you know, it would be cool if this was a shiny, my first, this was my first day encounter, like, you know, the, you know, first day, first day, first catch, first catch encounter, so this was my first catch, so, yeah, it's kind of funny, so my first catch in my brother's account was a shiny, and then when I was just, you know, I, I recorded this video and it's there in my Instagram, so yeah. I wish I recorded the, you know, reaction, so I really wish I recorded the reaction, but no, I did not. So yeah. And it turned out to be a hundo. It turned out to be a hundo. I was like screaming hundo, what? A hundo, what the hell was that? A hundo, what? So this is the hundred IV that I caught, not my brother, so I caught it. But in my brother's account, so since it's in my brother's account, I'm kind of jealous. Then, actually, I was kind of jealous and... Dude, then after that, of course, you saw my Shadow 100, 100 IV. So Shadow 100 IV and 100 IV shiny. So I count that as a fair because once I got my Shadow 100 IV, I didn't really feel that jealous. But you know, I wish I was a shiny. I wish I was a shiny. But I didn't feel that jealous. So that's why I was kind of happy. I got like the redemption I needed to get. So yeah. And so I, I actually traded this, um, this Sparky that I was talking about to trade long back because we're kind of bored. My brother wanted this Pokemon, so we traded it for that uh, this thing, the the bird Pokemon, what's it called? I forgot the bird Pokemon, that uh, yeah, it's Volibee, yeah, I caught this Volibee, so my brother caught this Volibee, so and I asked him why not trade it to me, because I do a lot of PvP things, so he said okay, and I, I gave him this guy back, I gave him the, um, I gave him, um, what's it called, this guy, my, uh, I gave him the Sparky that I wanted to, you know, trade it to him, so yeah, so Lux right here, so he only played a bit, so that's why he got like two shinies, he really didn't hunt for Lux Ray, but again, a female shiny here, again, a female shiny, and it's a good, no, it's a bad IV, so yeah. So my brother has more better IV shinies than me, so let me show you the good IVs here, three stars. So three star, I consider three star good, good IV, and of course he has a four star, which is a big win for him, so yeah. So he kind of has more than me, so he has eight, um, eight plus one, which is the four star Shondo, 
Shondo. So yeah, yeah. So this is actually I got it, so I consider like you know, I'm kind of happy. Um, the reason why I was not able to catch it was because that Pokemon fled. So that means like, you know there's like certain time for that specific Pokemon to stay. So when I opened my game, it it fled. So yeah, it fled. I was very sad. So let me just show you guys um the Hundos that my brother caught. Um, it's very funny. It's very funny. So let me show you the Hundos that my brother caught. So yeah. His, uh, let me just go with the time. Yeah, this was his first ever hundo. This was his first ever hundo. So I never knew this was a hundo. Actually, I caught this one. If I'm not wrong, I, yeah, I caught this one. So I caught this one. I was uh, playing. Um, I was playing with myself. So I caught this one. So this was my first ever hundo. So as I said for three months I was playing. Then my brother took the this thing. Then this was uh, this was I caught first in my main account, which is the evolution that one that you saw the evolution that you saw. Then my brother caught it. So yeah, first I caught it and it turned out to be a hundo and then uh, my brother caught it. So he has three hundos, of course. Um, yeah, he has three hundos and the recent two hundos that I got which made me more. So I, I have five hundos um, and then my brother has three hundos. So it's not a big deal. The other two I got it from the, you know, one from the GBL and one from the research. So yeah. So he got three hundos and his third hundo is a shondo. That's insane luck. I would say Brandon Tan would not even have his, he would not have it like, you know, his third hundo is a shondo. Shiny, so it's kind of a funny thing because my brother's third shiny, a third, uh, third hundo is a shundo. Yeah, it's kind, of, it's kind of funny, and he's like kind of lucky. So, this is technically me, I caught it, so I'm kind of lucky here. So, yeah, you don't consider that. Yeah, it's whatever you, whatever you guys, whatever you consider. So, yeah, and so my brother has full bags, so you know, he's not catching any Pokemon, and he didn't play December coming day because he had, he had no bag space. So, yeah, great coming day. I really enjoyed this, uh, December this year. I hope next year we get a lot of shinies. So yeah, hope you guys, um, New Year, Happy New Year guys. I hope to see you guys, you know, make new videos, do all this stuff. My expectation for my YouTube channel is somewhere around, you know, making over 60 to 70 videos, increase my videos and do good quality content. So, see you guys next time. I guess I've uh, completed my storage in my iPhone. So yeah, RIP. And you AirPods, you're not good here. You're not good. You're not like working. I have to give it to the Apple store to fix it. So see you guys next time. And Mika's leaving. Bye. Bye. So guys, uh, there's some more shinies that I want to do, like mention. I forgot to mention it here, so I, I forgot to mention when I was recording. So this is just voice record here. So yeah. Um. So what I meant by from my brother getting good IVs. So my brother gets quite a lot of good IVs. So so I forgot to mention some of them. Um. What I meant from good IVs, like you know, three stars and all those ones that I don't have. So so let me tell you guys how I caught this uh, uh 98 IV Samurai. So first thing is I did this coming day, not my brother, because you know I had some exams. I had exams during that time, and I wanted to get most out of it since I was not able to get that much shiny in my main account. Um, I used my brother's, and my brother was like you know not in the mood of playing this coming day. So I said you know let's get it. So you know, and then uh, this was a snapshot catch. It was from the snapshot here from Long. So I got it from the snapshot. So yeah. And what happened was after I got this from the snapshot, I was like very happy, cool, cool. And what happened was when I clicked on the appraise. It was insane. I went on the moon, guys. I was on cloud nine. That was like how, this was like insane. What the hell? But inside I was kind of sad because my brother got it, like not me. So that's like jealousy thing was there, but of course not a big deal. I don't really mind. It still considers as mine because I did this account and yeah, so it's, it's because I did this uh, uh, this thing coming day. I played the coming day, so it doesn't count. Similar to the, the other one I was talking about, similar to the um, um, Venonat. So yeah, this was the other thing I forgot to mention, this Pokemon. So I caught this uh, from the snapshot. Then this this guy from the of course um, from the that special research I mean that the time research and a sixty nine and my brother has kind of some zero IVs also which I forgot to mention which my account I don't have it so yeah I just want to see if there's any zero IVs here no zero IVs oh wait so I'll fast forward right now because I remember my brother catching some zero IVs so I guess he deleted some of them because zero IVs are really pointless yeah I found it so this is one zero IV that my brother caught um, see this is as rare as a hundo and I guess my brother deleted the other zero IV but I have a photo of it so it doesn't really matter I really didn't care about it because I didn't have backspace yeah my brother didn't have backspace so he deleted this one and I told my brother to not delete my champ here my choke here because my choke is really cool I mean so I told my brother to um, you know just keep this Pokemon safe so yeah that's why he kept this safe or then he would have deleted it really doesn't matter zero IV not good for PvP at all but yeah he has some zero IVs that I don't have and so that really is, I don't even have any zero IVs so yeah this was traded from me from the you know special day that you know go fest and so some more shinies here so cool and yeah that's it that's it that's, that's it I forgot to mention some of them so yeah So these are all the Pokemons he has. Of course, he re he relies on me most of the time because if you guys go, I'll just show you guys in the recent here. Um, just a second, I'm just go to the recent and I'll show you guys what happened. Um, so if you guys can, just can see here, um, um, this is the you know Halloween event. Uh, most of this is traded, so traded by me. So we all evolved this Pokemon. So because of that only, like, you know, he he relies on me most of the time. And also this Conqueror again traded from me. So that's the thing here, traded from me. So yeah. That's the thing here. Um, he relies on me most of the time, and when I do raids, I always call him, so it doesn't really matter for him. He personally does, he does, like, not that much raids and something. Wow, we had some Pokemon here. Cool. So my brother just hatched this guy, and it's not a hundo, but he already has a shiny, so it doesn't really matter for him. So, yeah. Uh, it's caught from US, it looks like. It was caught from the United States, hatched in Dubai, so yeah. And I guess I'll transfer this. Say goodbye. Thank you, guys. So, yeah. Bye.
Oh my god, I got my shiny meltdown! Let's do a quick check. Yo, that's a shiny meltdown, so beautiful. Oh my god, shiny meltdown. Yo, definitely bury this one. Oh, check it, oh, check it. Don't get the ball, please don't get the ball. Please, 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 please. Oh my god, okay. please get the ball. Please, please. Yes, we got the shiny meltdown. We got it, we got it, we got it. In our third check. Oh my god. Shiny Let's see the IVs, let's see the IVs. IVs, IVs. Oh, fine, still, still go. A shiny meltdown cut, bro! Guys, I can't believe what happened. I just got another shiny. I just got another shiny girl. I just got another shiny. What the hell This is MAQ and it's like 12.30 uh, a.m. in the morning and it's a shiny. We have a shiny guys. Encounter, get in. Encounter, please, no! No! I can't miss the encounter then. Rip! No! I missed the encounter. So I can't pop the encounter until I get back to it. Gone forever. So it turns out I finally got it back. What happened was the main I just really stole that area. So it's not looking back to the outside. And a shiny encounter at 12.30 uh, a.m. in the morning. Yo, that's awesome. Unexpected one. I kind of wanted to hunt for this guy, but we finally got this. I mean, I don't know if I should actually evolve this because I have enough candies to evolve it. Maybe to its final evolution. I don't know, guys. You guys tell me in the comments. Awesome, guys. Add it to the shiny collection, guys. This is awesome, guys. We finally got a shiny here, which knows the move Spark and Discharge. It's not a bad move, though. So, nice Pokemon shiny added into the collection. Looks like a level 20, if I'm not wrong. Like 25 or something. But yeah, a shiny in the night. Super cool. Someone's calling me for raids. Huh? I guess that's my mistake, I guess. But we got a shiny. We got a shiny. I'm, I'm just kidding. We, got, we, got, we literally got a shiny in the morning. In, in the next day, in the new day, I mean. Yo, that's awesome, guys. This is awesome. Yesterday, we got another Kanto shiny, which was actually a shiny, um, this thing, big ball. And today, we have this new shiny. I don't know what's going on with my shiny luck. Apparently, we have a lot of shiny luck here. It's only like 4% and I got my shiny. This is at morning, so 5 a.m. after Fezzer, so I like the Fezzer. So yeah, I'm just gonna look at this shiny. It's so cool! Morning shiny! Let's go, happy, let's go, let's go. Definitely gonna do this because it's difficult. You know what? I'll just give this common credit because it will uh, give me more chances of catching it. Ultra Ball, of course. Hit. Okay, so let's catch this. Let's, let's catch this, bros. Let's catch this. It's only 3% to 4%. If I miss it out, it's gonna be very difficult for me. Please, it's for the health product. Go inside. First catch, first try, first catch. That's awesome. We finally got a shiny here. Oh well, shiny. Today we got our first shiny. And that's awesome. Bad IVs, I don't really care, but it's a shiny, guys. It's a shiny at just at the morning. I guess I'm gonna get my new streak again. And I'm getting so many Generation 3 starters. I mean, Generation 3 shinies. Shift to Astaka, this is one Generation 3 Pokemon that is a shiny. It's shiny Skitty. And now we have shiny Trico. Yep, this is the morning. Morning shiny of the day. Guys, can you see this? We have the shiny. Just look at it right now. We have the shiny. I'll show you. This is the shiny. And let's look at the oh shoot. I will see like this. Yeah. A shiny already. Wow, this is so awesome. My brother already has this shiny for secret from this thing. Shiny Lamia. Like, not Lamia. It's called like Galarian Meow, I guess. Yeah, like the Galarian Meow from the Beauty Search. I'm very lucky. Lots of the shop that we should show you guys in the YouTube video. So, yeah. So let me just catch this very quickly. This is awesome, man. I was not too difficult to catch. We don't have good IVs in CD. We said it's 200 today. I'm not going to delete it. But yeah. 
cool, cool. Let's get it. Let's get it now. Shiny deck. Shiny deck added. Cool. I mean, I thought this Pokemon won't be a shiny, but since it was weather boosted, let me just catch it for this. You know, I'll tell you guys why I went, why I caught this was just because you know to complete this, you know, eight different species of uh, Pokemon, catch eight different species of Pokemon, and then you can win a raid under sixty seconds will give me a Snorlax. I'm hunting for that shiny Snorlax. But wow, did I just get a shiny? This is just awesome, guys. Another night nice shiny catch. Last time was um, this thing. What's it called? Last time was Magnemite, and today's shiny Trubbish. Let me just show you that. Shiny Trubbish. This game already, this came in, of course, uh, the you know, Ultra Unlock Part 3, but didn't get one. And this is, again, weather boosted. And this is going to be our first catch of the day. Why not six it? And hopefully I'll evolve it in the future. It looks awesome. Shiny Trubbish, an exclusive shiny. Not exclusive, I mean, it's like a generation six or something. Cool shiny. Of course, I, I you know, close the music. I don't want to listen to the music. Enter in the Poke Bowl. Cool, cool, cool. This is the new shiny of the day. I just caught it exactly at 12 a.m. <laughs> That's awesome. 12 a.m. and our fourth day streak. What a cool Pokemon. But yeah, again, I just want to show you one more thing. I got an exclusive spawn, which is Cubone, and Cubone is like super rare and wild, so let me just quick catch it. Did we just saw a shiny Cyndaquil? Dude, this one is definitely gonna be buried. This one is definitely burying today. Of course, yes. Catching this. No quick catches here, because I want to see the dex entry for a shiny Cyndaquil. I mean, of course, Cyndaquil is my first ever Pokemon, so I'm gonna evolve the first ever Pokemon I caught, so yeah. Oh no, don't fly, don't fly, don't fly. This one definitely requires a Golden Raz, because I don't want to lose it. And as you all know, shinies do, I mean, you know, starters do get out of the Pokeball, so it's gonna be a difficult one to see, though. Just enter inside the Pokeball. Just enter inside the Pokeball. Just enter inside the Pokeball. Please, please. Yes! Caught the shiny, dude. Finally, a shiny Cyndaquil. Dude, this is just insane. Shiny, uh, very bad IVs though, but by the way, it's a shiny Cyndaquil. Definitely yes, my favorite uh, Gen 2 starter, or my, you know, my most favorite starter. Yo, that's awesome. Of course, it's a Kamite shiny, but yeah. Let's go.